A little anesthesia. Some bastard tried to mug me. I handled it. Oh, local guy. You really think somebody local will try to mug me, Pepe? Listen, V. I got a problem. Serious this time. Come on, spin it. What is it now? It's a uh, cork. I owe him. Don't pay by tomorrow, said he'd bust my legs. He don't joke about that stuff. Got cartels in his corner. You in it with Kirk? Every man, woman, and rat in Haywood knows he's a fucking shark. My bro jumped the joint. Deserve the hero's welcome. I know I fuck up. I'm V. <laughs> you ever gonna get wise, Pepe? Please tell me your brother's doing all right. Uh, doing his thing, you know. So, can you help? I'll talk to Kirk, but then you're gonna owe me one. And you're saving. you need. Pepe asked me to talk you up. What, he too shot a hand over the Yetis himself? Uh, tell him I don't fight. Not yet. What's he owe you? I'm afraid that's client confidentiality. We'll call it a lot. We'll leave it at that. A cred shark with business ethics. Sounds too good to be true. Well, Merry fucking Christmas. Cut him some slack, will you? He'll pay. Just need some more time. Do I look like a priest that runs a charity to you? You borrow Eddie's, you gotta pay him back. With interest. It's common fucking knowledge. You suggesting I let a flaky cunt who can't keep a deal off the hook? No, you let him off because it's me asking. Huh, <laughs> you know me. I'm a man of the bids. So I need to know what I get out of it. Transactions go two ways, I get that. I'll owe you a favor. Got a Nova idea already. What's this? Grab a look. Mm hmm. Cream ride there on the page. Only four of them in NC as of now. One, Rayfield Regional Director. Two, 
Mayor Ryan. Three, a rental service. Uh-huh, and four? Number four will belong to my client, just as soon as you clep it for me, that is. I do this, and Pepe's debt is squared? Of course. I'm a man of my word. You know that. Whole thing simple. You swipe the ray field for me, I clear Pepe's account. Even toss in a cut for you, I'm such a nice guy. My man Rick works a parking structure by Embers, club where our ray field driver likes to kick it. There every Friday night, like clockwork. As soon as you appear, security cam shut down, gate swings up, the road is yours. Just gotta grab the ray field and roll out. Simple. Who's the owner? Just an Arasaka suit from across the water. Spews cash out of every hole in his body. And his name? How would I know? Why would I care? It's a hot item and I know where to find it. Kinda in a rush here. And your man Rick? Trust him like my own brother. How am I supposed to do this? Expect me to slide under the chassis on a skateboard for a quick hot wire? Fast and easy? Kirk, wheels like this got security systems. Good ones. This bitty bop works like the key Rayfield techs use for repairs. Opens locks, bypasses identity authorization. A skeleton key for all Rayfields in the city. <laughs> Come on, Kirk, even you don't buy that. Kabuki's tech wizards sell more magical shit than this under the counter. Have a little faith. So, we all agreed then. Best keep your word, Kirk. Easy, V. Job's gonna pad your wallet too, you know? Head to Ember's in the Glen. Rick's in the garage. Be waiting for you. You two will hit it off. Good luck out there. I'll be in touch. See no goddamn Please. lemons, no goddamn limes. They're in there, for sure. Go to the darling, son. Tell them to be ready. Yes, Padre. Well, who do we have here? We? Long time. Didn't know you were around. Sebastian Ibarra. Haven't changed a smidge. No one calls me by my name anymore. 
Almost forgotten how it sounds. How are things, Padre? The same. Haywood. Nothing ever changes here. But I'd rather hear about you. V. Yep. No place like home. V, I'm listening. back from Atlanta a few weeks ago. See you got a good down-home welcome. How was it back east? I'll tell you later. Got something on my plate. How about you fill me in now? We'll give you a ride. Marcus, let's go. So where to? The Glen. Drop me off at Embers. Front door? Take the ramp, back of the bar. Show you where to stop. You heard it, Marcus. Your return to NC has been good? Busy already? Eh, I pick up something here and there. Nothing major. But I'm getting by. Appreciate the concern. So... Atlanta didn't turn out like you expected, huh? Went there without expectations, actually. Well, except that it'd be better than here. It wasn't. Maybe it'll all work out for the best. Stop the car. What's going on? Business. You carry? Sebastian Ibarra. Looks like it's my lucky day. What do you want? To settle our biz, once and for all. Got an offer for you, Patty, so listen up. Get the fuck out of Vista. Pull your boys off the street. I'll give you the Glen. Done deal. No more restless nights. See how generous I can be? Well, Patty... One more what's... fucking word. Stay out of this. I don't know you. And I don't know you. Which means you're worth shit around here, and capable of even less. Well? Anything else? It seems our conversation has come to a close. Careful, Padre. Never know who's got a barrel at your six. You neither, shit bucket. Marcus, please. I am pleased to see you have not forgotten your roots. Still have the gift. So many of the little shits left around here. Their spines go soft when they look down a barrel. Pull up here. Right here. I'll just drop down below. Here, before you go. Your number could be useful. Maybe we can also work together again. Take ourselves back two years. Thanks, Padre. Gotta go. 
So go with God. Find your man. Rick's one of the good guys, you'll see. I trust him like a brother. Yeah, so you said. Take for a whirl. You're a man of little faith. See? We're rich. Now fire her up and call me when you're underway. I'll tell you where to go. Hmm. Looks like this will be a cool breeze. Ain't to me. Left for Atlanta, looking for a slice of happiness. Guess you didn't find it. I've always maintained it's the same for all you termites in Haywood. Born here, live here, die here. Looks like I was right. Rat no, got your tongue? Fuck all about me. Truth hurts, huh? Just watch your tone. I'm not a patient man. Come on, Stan. Give us a break, huh? You lock us up, I just jerk off till trial. And then what? Worst case, we get some months. Hell, standing room only nowadays in El Bote. So... They'll probably be out early. Are these the thieves? Fuck ordinary yeah. street trash. Got him in custody, Mr. Fujioka. We'll be taking him now. It's a waste of effort. I have no time to testify or play it on an investigation. Suggesting we let him go, sir? I suggest you toss them in the sea. Cuff legs broken so this trash doesn't float. You heard him. Fuck.
Honestly, for a sec there, things looked iffy. Wasn't sure we'd worm out of that alive. Man, <laughs> same. Stints is out to get people, wound tight. But he does have a little honor left. Really think his sense of honor saved us? Well, and the fact he's Haywood born and bred like us. If I hadn't come, you'd be cruising Night City in sexy wheels right now. Nah, come on. Job was toxic from the start. Even Kabuki under the counter magic can't get around an alarm like that. Should have known I'd have the PD on my ass. So, maybe now, as God ordained. Jackie Wells. V. I know you. You hang at the Coyote. Wait, Wells? Like Mama Wells. <laughs> Thought I'd recognize the name. She's my blood, all right. Coyote's her dive. It's strange you and I never met before. Got the job to steal those wheels at the Coyote. From Kirk. You work with that sewer slug? Pepe wasn't big and can't afford to pay, so I stepped up. Man, gotta wonder about Pepe letting slimy Kirk boss him around like that. Heard what they say. He's backed by cartels. Cartels? No, no, listen. I know those cartel types, and I guarantee you, none of them have even heard of Kirk. El cabrón's gotta learn. He don't do people in Haywood dirty. Come on, let's go have some lunch. Just like that? You put a barrel to my skull not so long ago. You help my homies. You're okay in my book. No harm, no foul. None at all. Getting one of my good feelings. About what? About us. It's a kind of chemistry, you know? Come on. I'm fucking starved. Okay. Food it is. Let's go. of us in this city of dreams. Ooh, I love this town. Love it like you might love a mother who popped you out on the steps of an orphanage once and now stops you to ask if you got a smoke for her. Every new day here means a hundred new arrivals, but only half these gods will survive a year, and that's if it's a good one. And why do these peeps come to NC? Well, to be street samurai like Morgan, Blackhand, and Waylon Boa Boa. The greater the risk, the bigger the bounty, kids. Or so they say. But you can only be a major league player for so long. The faster you live, the faster you burn out. If you don't get a bullet to the brain first. Legends, know where you'll find most of them? The graveyard. Matters not where you're from, matters not where you start. What matters here is the walk you walk. In Night City, the city of dreams. The chick we're looking for is somewhere in this building. Probably crawling with the pendejos that kidnapped her. 
Eyes and ears open, all right? Speaking of which, got you a little something. Militech training shard. In case you need to, uh, brush up on your dance moves. Down for some target practice in VR? Militech? Jack, we're talking classified military-grade shit here. How'd you get it? T-Bug. And our girl made a couple adjustments. Why? Think she knows better? Nah. Said it didn't suit her, uh, style. <laughs> You'll see what I mean. Sure. Why the hell not? Let's begin with basic combat training. This session will be recorded for subsequent evaluation. This course is designed to reinforce your fundamental combat abilities and hone your... I will train you to be effective with firearms, to use stealth tactics to your advantage, and to hack into enemy networks. Because at Militech... Man, Militech can't encrypt for shit. But they clearly got drilling jarheads in their blood. Now, station one, you maggot! Move, move! Hope you're ready to bust ass through this fascist playground. Let's blast through a tactical target practice program. You know, a little warm up. Say we crank it up a notch. Not bad. But it's more realistic if the targets quit standing around and take cover. You took a hit. Use a reanimator to patch yourself up. Head to the training area when you're good to go. Oh, look. Brought some chooms with him this time. You know what to do, dude. Dream work, V. Stand on the platform and we'll move on. the next item on the menu. Might notice I tweaked the course material a bit. This training module will teach you how to apply technological tools, work a little hack magic on the screen to distract the guard. Four boats, 
trash. Style over substance. Good. Now take him out quietly. All right, all yours. Take him out. Never smart to leave behind any trace of your handiwork. Especially the dead kind. Now pick up the body and hide it somewhere. Okay. Now try to take him down in one slick move. Ready to try hacking some gonks in real time? Have fun! Now, detonate the grenade. Needed to shut your brain down and follow orders in true Militech fashion. Got additional modules if you want to hone any other skills. Before you finish up, Delta out now. But remember, the street's not going to give you any hints or second chances. Right. So first, let's shape up those stealth skills.
Find cover, quick. <laughs> nice, nice. Now, move slowly towards the exit. Stay out of sight. Stealthy now, V. You ever relive a ninja BD? Nova, well done. On to the next area. Now the same thing, only with the camera. Um, sightseeing? Nice work today. Just stand on the platform to exit the city. Time to get down and dirty in close quarter combat. Take him down, but careful. Looks tough. Okay, that'll do. Now maybe we find someone closer to your weight class. Let's bump things up from easy to normal. This next fool can block your attacks. Dull bit coming up now. Blocking blows instead of dealing them. Now this fool loses his footing every time he swings. Use that. Get in there and land a counterpunch. I like that. V, 
Wanna see this fool? Punch an air next. Don't let him... You've done well in mastering the way of the fool, young apprentice. I can teach you no more. This is the part where you face your final test. Let's move on to melee weapons. Grab a sword. Now show me what you've learned. Like you're cruising already. Hop on the platform. Good luck, V. So? Not bad, huh? Now we can get down to biz. Let's do this. Elevator. This way. Targets Sandra Dorset. Targets Biomon went mute a couple hours back. Suspected abduction. Target could have possibly flatlined already. Not sure you're in time. We're in time, Bug. We. Sure you're on phones, but that don't make you any less part of this squad. Squad. Charming. Calm the hell down, both of you. Almost there. Yeah, Bug. You focus. Looking for 1237. Target should be inside, but I got zero eyes on her biomob. Fingers crossed it's not too late. You? Ugh, I hate this life or death shit. Hurry. Try hacking the door. Think you can trip it on your own, V?
Sandra Dorset's protected under Echelon 2. This one's packing black market Zeta Tech repros. Typical back alley fix ups. Not our lucky gal. Let's keep looking. Where the hell's our target? Look around. Gotta be there somewhere.
Jesus fucking Christ. I think I got her. Got our target. We make it? She alive? About to find out. V, Jack into our biomod. Need to know what we're dealing with. Oh, this does Jacking not in. look good. Sandra Dorset, NC570442. Trauma Team Platinum. Platinum? Shit. Trauma should have swooped in if she sneezed. Guessing they jammed the transmitter, sick. Looking at a hacked biomon, firmware reconfig, or a neurovirus. Carajo, T Bug. You ain't seeing this. Ice hooks the cleavers. Hmm. Scott Muncher's hack, huh? Got an idea. Check her neuroport. Find a shard? Yeah, pull it. That'll be what's muting the biomob. Is that even safe? Can't we just get her out of here? We found her still breathing. Can't lose her. We need that biomob working. Checking for hemorrhages, whatever. Find that shard and yank it. Found the shard. Removing now. Check the biomod. Anything changed? Greetings, Sandra. If you are conscious, assume recovery position now. An emergency evacuation unit has been dispatched and is due to arrive at your location in 180 seconds. Biomon claims trauma will be here in three minutes. Your premium plan will cover 90% of the projected costs of your rescue and treatment. Ay, pobrecita. Let's get her off that ice. Jack, look sharp. Not done yet. Don't know who's out there. Locked and ready, hermano. Do your thing. Oh, fuck! He's flatlining! V, need to know what's going Jackie, on. Jackie, air hypo! Fuck, this is bad! Hey, get, vato! I think... Holy shit, it worked. Fuera, cabrón. Get her outside. Fuera, get her out. Terrace. Let's get out of here. 
Elevator gets us to the garage direct. Good work. Shit show's over. Cutting my wires now. See you in the near future. Listen, Mano. I got this thing. Mind if I borrow your wheels? Hmm. I got a day with Misty, but I can't take the metro. How's I gonna look for me? Won't leave you hanging, Jack. But don't get used to it. Drive you home, huh? She's all yours. I'm beat as it is. Oh, almost forgot. Should get Wakako in the hollow. Tell her the job's done. Relatively well. Trauma team took her off our hands. She'll recover. Splendid. Your payment awaits you. Ready to come and grab whenever you like, even right away. But I guess home is the only place you wish to be now. The NCPD has surrounded Watson. The district is closed. If you're to make it past the cordon, you must move fast. Thanks for the heads up. Swing by to see you later. Words out the NCPD is gonna put Watson on lockdown. If I'm gonna sleep in my own bed tonight, we better put it in fifth. Leave it to me, Mano. I'm driving. Stop digging Night City. City like any other. Just bigger. Nah, Mano. Not just any other city. Morgan Blackhand. Andrew Wayland. Adam Smasher. Legends are born here. <laughs> Man, I'm starving. Let's grab a tight bite. What do you say? Jackie... They're locking down Watson, remember? Oh shit, you're right. Is it just me or oh, I know it? Man on her ass. Hello. Drive, Jackie! Come on, V! Shoot! Can't keep her steady! Hold tight, V! Mierda! Perdón! your baby up pretty bad. Sorry, V. It's okay. It can wait. Let's just focus on getting home.
chingada madre! Damn. We're pulling out all the stops. What does the lockdown do for the Nerdist? Necessary security measure. Officer, ma'am! Damn, are we ever lucky we ran into you. Really? What's it that makes me so special? A heart of gold? Because only somebody with a heart of gold can understand just how much I need to get back to my girl. Your... girl? Uh-huh. I'm gonna be worried sick if I don't show. I mean, I'm trying to be a stand-up guy. She's giving me a chance. Waiting. Hmm. That's a shame. Let them through. But they're the last. Okay. On your way. You have a good evening now, officer, ma'am. So you can be nice when you feel like it. When am I not nice? Um, always? I'm always never not nice. Almost at your place. What about you? Not likely to make it back to Haywood now. Kill V? They'll let me through. Sure about that? Oh, yeah. I'll play nice Jackie again. dreams then Shh. gonna be Don't long I said hi I will I luego
first guest tonight is the president Bug. of the church of Alabama. Forgot earlier. A runner I know has something you could probably use. Zip in your deeds. Praise be to thee, our Father in heaven. And our second guest is Karina Lee, host of the Chip End program, which promotes the use of cybernetic implants. I love treating you, beautiful. Can't complain, Ziggy. Thanks for having me. I might have caught something when I jagged into that corpo's bile mine. Don't know, uh, neurovirus or. Need to see Vic. Let him tell me what's got my head reeling, my stomach churning. Okay, let me take you. I brought you a ride. Yeah, throw on some threads, meet me downstairs. How'd you find me? How'd you even know my name? I know where to gather my intel. Could even call me a collector. Later, Don't please. Shit. Yes, that's a weak looking. I would... That has no sense. Got another drink. 
dry, sun-filled streets come in your way, Night City. But soak in that sun while you can. There's a cold frost moving in. We got a call! We're here to help! We know you're in there! How you like my new punching bag? Just gave me a next-gen ass whooping he did. Be curious to see how he handles the likes of me. <laughs> so how about it? Long enough. Worked up an appetite. Just waiting. Sit down. Let me finish this. Then we can drop in on Senor Vector. I mentioned something about a surprise yesterday. Am I remembering right, or just had a brain fart? Probably both, because you usually forget shit. But it just so happens, I think I might have bagged us a sweet ass J.O.B. Go on. I mean, maybe it's not as big as that, but just that he's fronted by a little-known someone named Dexter Deshaun. Only the top fixer in night fucking city. Fat-ass black Jesus of the afterlife. 300 pounds of partly gold-plated cool. I'm fat. Oh, 
Thought Dex bounced out of the ring a few years ago. Messed with the nasty crew in Pacifica. Things got ugly. Mm-hmm. Gang wars two years back. Somehow Dex got caught up in the craziness. There's a lot of bodies lying in the streets by the time the shooting stopped. Yeah, Dex got lucky, though. Managed to slip under the radar till tempers cooled. Took a while, but he's made one hell of a comeback. This is it, Jackie. Our break. Dex needs friends, needs us. We can use him. Amen, I said. It's a win-win. So what's the gig? We meant to come out in one piece? Our Lord and Savior wants to tell you everything himself, face to face. Oh, no pressure, but, uh, this whole deal, he's riding on you now, I say. I'm fine. Why do I gotta go? You and T-Bug draw straws without me? T-Bug and Dex go way back, and my face is yesterday's news. Well, Dex says he needs to check you. Look, V, it's his job, his rules. I can't blame him for taking a personal approach. And it ain't as bad as you think, okay? Trust me. Guess I got no choice then. Dex is a real deal when it comes to fixers. Don't get me wrong. Don't got nothing against the Padre or Wakako, but Dex is gonna leave his own. Oh, really? No. It's always the same story. You land on fresh turf, local fixer waves his dick around, but he's smiling, saying you'll be up to your neck in gigs and eddies. Still, all you are is another name in their little black book. Nifty tool for getting them a fat slice of whatever half-baked shit pie their client put on the table. Sure, you crack jokes over drinks, but in the end, it's biz. Gracias, Dios. Where you know? Brought your wheels. Gave them to my guy yesterday to smooth over the dents after our, uh, dust off and scabs. Thanks, Jack. Much appreciated. Some top notch work Miguel did. Rides like it looks. Factory new. We'll see about that. Are we rolling or what? Let's feel this factory new ride. on the gas, huh? I just ate. I was supposed to stop by Vic's anyhow. I got a date. Me and Miss D. You don't say. She's so sweet. Really gets me, you know? Sit tight over here. Me and Misty got a little catching up to do. Vicky, spry as ever, you old ripper. It's good to see you. Good to see you too, V. It's been a while. What do I owe the pleasure today? Last gig. Had to jack into a client's neuro socket. Think I might have gotten spiked. Experiencing migraines, nausea, hypersensitivity to bright lights. Whole kit and caboodle. All right, kid. 
We'll sort you out in a flash. Besides that, how are things? Need some new kit, but tools, not toys, Vic. Time I bumped up my sights and got a grip. <laughs> really? Now? Finally? Vic, shit's getting real. Got a job from Dex to Sean, hitting the major leagues. Me tech that can perform. The Dexter Deshaun? <laughs> well, that is something. But let me guess. Hasn't paid you yet. Quit crying, Vic. I'll bring you the Eddies later. With interest. You know I will. Hmm. Last time. You hear? Chair, please. Sit down and relax. Kuroshi Optics. Best I've got, and should be about right under the circumstances. Now jack in. You peruse and choose while I scan. Let's see what's going on inside. Mark one, like I said. Decent enough scanner. Displays data on your cornea. Cherry on the top's a built-in external lens disruptor. In layman's terms, any surveillance cam will capture your face as a blur. And just remember, your body will still show up as crystal clear. Hmm. This should do the trick. She tech too. I'm ready. Carve away. Excellent. Let's do this. Lay that major league arm of yours right here. Just like that. Thanks. Now, a bit of anesthetic and I can start cutting. Feel anything? Play by play, though? Really, Doc? Makes it sound like a dentist. Always going on and on. Don't be mean now. Remember, I'm old. I got a shaky Gannick hand. Could slip. Lights out for a minute, all right? Test this. See the magic in action. Thinking you in. 
You might feel a little discomfort at first. Blurred vision, low contrast, glitches. Well, how's it look? Feel all right to you? Oh, this is fantastic, Vic. <laughs> oh, beautiful. For the scanner. It might take you a few seconds to adjust, but first time's really the charm, <laughs> with anything, really. The scanner should eventually sync with your thought processes and read your intentions. I also inject an NCPD file search. Run into any ne'er do wells? <laughs> you know exactly what they ne'er did well. <laughs> it ought to work like a charm. Now draw your weapon. You should see your ammo count in a brand new site. How about the neurovirus from the last job? Can you check it? Done and gone while we were putting in your implant. And a full sweep on your soft and circuits. Zap the critter. You're certified bug free. Shit, Victor, not bad. I don't know what to say. Say so you'll take this and remember the dosage. Two whiffs now, and another two in an hour. Thanks again, Vic. You're the best. I owe you. <laughs> Go on, kid. Show them what you're made of. And once you hit the big leagues, don't forget where you came from. I can release it for you, but you'd have to watch out for negative energy fields and avoid mean reds. V, and... yo, listen up. I talked to Dex while you were in with the doc. He's waiting in his ride for you. Ain't but a hop to where he's parked next to Gramsci Burgers. Okay, do my best to talk us up. matters to me for a few reasons there are people who say cyber psychosis can be treated right and i know exactly how that sounds but i believe even an unproven therapy is still better than a bullet to the brain if i get a tip about a possible attack i'll give you a call maybe you can investigate before max tack hits the scene but remember you're not there to execute anybody try to incapacitate the attacker and i'll send someone to pick him up i hope that's all clear Mr. V, a pleasure. Dexter Deshaun in the flesh. Ample indeed. <laughs> Let's roll.
Mind if I ask you something right off the bangle? Would you rather live in pieces, Mr. Nobody, die ripe, old, and smelling slightly of urine, or go down for all times in a blaze of glory, smelling near like posies, without seeing your 30th? It's first place or no place, Dex. Cost isn't a factor. <laughs> Classic. I'd expect nothing less from eager, supple youth. Respect. All right, listen close. Scanning a serious job now. Playing gargantuan compared to smashing up a scav home. Let me hear it. What's the job? There's this prototype tech. A biochip, to be precise. The job's to grab it. Simple. Yeah. <laughs> Guessing it belongs to a court. Mm-hmm. Arasaka. Surely that's no problem. No, no problem. Just a death sentence. NC's Arasaka's turf. Nobody fucks with them here. What can I say, Mr. V? High risk, high reward. First rule of the afterlife. Besides that, I'm no leadhead. Ain't gonna leave no trace for them to follow because we're gonna do this clean and on the hush-hush. We understand each other. You work this out? Got a plan? Two things. First, a conundrum with the Maelstrom boys. Needs active resolving that. Second, to rendezvous. Simple. Klein who brought us the job's anxious. She wants to parlay with one of the team. What's the issue needs resolving with Maelstrom? Got a beef? Slot in the shard. Got a classic tale for you. Psycho gang doing his thing two weeks back. Jumped a Militech convoy. Got away with the gear. Corp don't even know Maelstrom's involved. Now see, convoy was carrying the flathead. A little combat bot, a prototype. And I need me that bit of high grade military tech. Cause if we don't get that bot, we don't get no soccer chip. And we sure as hell don't get no happily ever after. But don't get excited. It's a single-use toy. Now, I flat out purchased the damn thing from Maelstrom. Problem is, I did so from a gent went by the name of Brick. I say when, because Brick was the leader. Three days after we'd sealed our deal, his friend and gangmate one Simon Randall, AKA Royce, plain dropped his ass. Royce is in charge now, and I got no way of knowing if he aims to honor his predecessor's word. To add to this shipstream, one Meredith Stout of Militech has developed an interest in said convoy. Who's the prima donna? Corpo agent, internal affairs. Been skidding around town asking after the convoy as if her life depended on finding it. The one lead she's got zip tied in her trunk. Stick up her ass ain't growing any shorter, so she must be getting desperate. Be wise to think how you could use that. Of course, to do so, you'll need that frazzled cat's info. Sending it now. Klein, what's her thing? Why she need to meet? Woman's name's Evelyn Parker. Betting her wasn't easy. Put the word out I was looking for any kind of intel. Right, and? Some brothers from Pacifica got back to me. Told me to stop looking. End of convo. <laughs> anyway. Our little client insisted on meeting someone with skin in the game. You know, we'll be there for it all. Yours truly will be remote. T-Bug ain't no people person, and Jaggy's only good at some things. I know you know what I mean. Pretty much leaves you. I think I got everything. Time I got to work. Well, that's just music to my ears. I'll set up the meet with Miss Parker at Lizzie's bar. Flathead, though, is gonna be all you.
One more thing, Mr. B. Quiet life or a blaze of glory? Hmm? Later now. Dexter, talk to Dex. Yeah, <laughs> Gordito's a big deal. Literally a nod, yeah? Clem to want to check our pro cred. But to me, it feels more like he tangled us up with Maelstrom and Militech. There's this combat bot, military prototype. Maelstrom clept it. Then Dex paid to take it off their hands just before the Gangoons had a switch up in management. Right, right, heard about that. Royce versus Brick. Hostile takeover. That sums it up. Dex wants us talking to Royce. Gave the deets of some Militech agent, too, but... I don't know how much help she stands to be. Ha! <laughs> Hang on. Yeah, he don't sound thrilled. Royce, what do you know about him? He's fucking whack something special. Junkie snort junk. Royce snorts... Then there's the other thing. Gotta meet the client who put the job on the table. Evelyn Parker. You? Well, what's Dex gonna do? Ride around in his limo, chat chicks up on the hollow? Parker wants to meet someone on the crew. Dex gave me the nod. He must know what he's doing. So, how you wanna play this? Maelstrom or Parker? What's first? Parker. I think I ought to see her first. See what she's like, what she's after. In that case, I'll hit the all foods. Put my nose to the ground. Step around. Hasta luego. Wondering, this heist heralding in the triumphant return of Dex Deshaun to the fixers table? <laughs> Gotta admit, a few years from my seat has left me with a bit of an appetite. She come dropping in with a bang. Deshaun ain't just a name, it's a brand. About time my clientele remember who they do biz with. But you got my word, you don't disappoint, you'll get your cut. With interest. Let's get back to work. Be in touch.
なに命を無駄にし、どうせろ。B、got a rat problem on my block. Who doesn't, right? Thing is, these rats are human sized. Look just like tiger claws, too. Biggest one is a certain Taki Kenmochi. So do your fixer a solid and neutralize her ass, will ya? Deeds attached. That's what it's all about. 
one less tiger in this town. Appreciate your problem solving skills, V. Get it closed. Any nice threads for me? If thrift falls into your definition of nice, then sure.
Got word of a cyber psycho attack, all confirmed. Even reported to Max Tech. Thing is, nobody's gonna show because Militech shut it right down. You ask me, Psycho's gotta be one of theirs. My Eddie's are on Lieutenant Mower. Anyway, Corporal's gonna go straight into treatment. So make very, very sure you keep her in one piece.
used to be a media, didn't you? Not hard to guess, but I'll give you a point for perceptiveness. Why you stop? Never stopped, really. Information is a weapon, B. I just traded in for a larger caliber. See you around. Bye, V. Remember, the media lies. Thank you. 
what? You want a new friend? Do I know you? Looking a little put out there, input. Interest you in a preem BD? Sure. In I go. Hold it. House rules first. There will be severe penalties for any unauthorized recording. No drugs, no groping. Someone catch your eye? You do not grab them. You find them in the catalog, ask for a BD, and get yourself a box. I really look that green to you. Like I don't know. Mm-hmm. Doors open. Have fun, input. Welcome to Lizzie's. My, what a sweet little face you have. Get you something. I'm looking for Evelyn Parker. You know if she's here? Who's asking? Name's V. She and I have a uh, date. Well, V, it's a pleasure. I'm Mateo. Uh huh. So, Evelyn? Club's big. We're gonna have to look around. Can't do it for you. It's all right, Mateo. Evelyn Parker. I knew it was you as soon as you walked in. Since on, only tequila I drink. <laughs> How would you know? I like to know everything about the people I work with. Either that or it was just a lucky guess. Mind if we talk about the job? Heard you got something for me. Mm. But not here. Come with me. We'll be in the lounge, Mateo. Anyone asks, we're not here. So, what can a corny girl That's like me Really? Why don't you just tell me the truth? I just told you. had a load to say about you. Called you professional, effective, and trustworthy. I hope he wasn't overselling. You don't give a rat's dick what Dex thinks. We both know that. You have trouble accepting compliments? No, just think flattery's beneath you. Am I wrong? Dex is beneath you. Have you known each other long?
Just started working with them, in fact. I've heard there are two kinds of fixers. Those with stable crews on long contracts and short leashes. Loyalty and predictability they value above all else. Then there's the other kind. Dex's kind. Come on. Can't leave that hanging. Headhunters. They lay their trust elsewhere, not in people, but in a thing. Their intuition. They bet on potential. And if they lose that bet, it's the last mistake they ever make. I'm hoping Dex's intuition has served him well in this case. Let's cut to the chase. What do you got for me? Your target. I trust you know what it is. Relic. Secure your soul trinket. Key tech in the program, actually. We're tangling with Arasaka, making this heist one dangerous, risky motherfucker. Mm-hmm. Arasaka's poured billions into personality transfer technology. But me, I just want the data on this one. The chip is tucked away inside Compeki Plaza, the hotel. You ever been? You know, just never rolled through that neighborhood. Damn shame. The fresh they serve is sinfully good. Chef must have made a deal with the devil. So where's this chip hiding exactly? In a suite on the top floor. The room's occupied by Yorinobu Arasaka. Yorinobu Arasaka? He's in town? Don't you read the scream sheets? The media couldn't get enough of Yori coming to Night City. It was all over the headlines. Anyway, he's heir apparent to the Arasaka Empire. Saburo Arasaka's only surviving son. What? So Arasaka Jr.'s planning to grab the reins while in Night City? Only a handful of people in Night City know what the Arasaka's real plans are. Tell me you're one of them? Look, if you've got any spare aces up your sleeve, now's the time to show them. Now this should make your prick perk up. Yorinobu recently swiped the chip from an Arasaka laboratory. He's made a deal with Netwatch. Aims to sell it to them. Have you spotted my ace yet, or do I need to spell things out? Fine. So no Arasaka security on the device, because Yorinobu whisked it away in secret. Now, where's he hiding it? Well, likely in a specialized container. One that mimics an organic neural environment. On the outside, it looks like an ordinary briefcase. And the case is... You'll see for yourself soon enough. Provided we're done gossiping about the Arasakas. Okay, what's next? Now comes the best part. Follow me. Got something for you. Should help you plan. Brain dance from Compeki Plaza. How's a brain dance supposed to help? Need facts, not thrills. I think BDs are only good for fondling virtual tits. Jacking off yeah, to and those... I said I'd no. come to you. It can be a very useful tool. Good for analyzing details, human perception, even boosted. Doesn't grasp exactly what you need. So what's on the tape? Yorinobu's suite. The glorious interior. You'll need to locate the relic yourself. Hope I grabbed enough detail to make that possible. Hold up. Mean to say you recorded this? Mm-hmm. BD rec implant. Why, you object? Supposed to be Yorinobu's pad on the tape. Means you were inside. You know each other? How else could I get all this intel? Mm -hmm. I know him pretty well, actually. We have an arrangement. Strictly business. Suits us both, I think. Judy'll help. She's a moth. Judy's always been there for me. Uh -huh. Always helped no. out. No, 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 no. I trust no. her. But she's uh, a mox, not, not the latest member of your crew. Try not to forget. So, you'll be a good boy, tread lightly, and keep that tongue on a leash. Relax. Believe it or not, I'm no stranger to tact. In biz or life. <clears throat> hey. 
Hey, there you are. This is V. He's here for that BD role. And V, this is Judy. Best brain dance editor I know. Enough already. Hey, Judy. Compiled your BDF. What do you think? Will it do? Still pretty raw, but yeah, ought to do. Mm-hmm. V needs to get deep inside. That's most important. So, let's calibrate. Tune it to him. Believe me, I've dealt with worse. Should see the jig jig street porn we gotta contend with sometimes. So we drop V inside. Let him look, let him rummage around, right? How about it, V? Raw brain dance. Ever taken a dip before? Look, I'm no BD virgin, but the raw stuff? Uncharted territory. Relax. I'll explain everything. It's less complicated than it sounds. Sit down. Settle in, and we'll get you going. To create your sensory profile first. Okay. Hit me. Just promise me it won't hurt. It won't. Not this time. Now sit still. Look at me. Gonna run the analysis soft. Should feel a slight tingling. Mm hmm. Okay, now let's set the optics and other sensory six. Look smack into these two screens. Pretend it's an eye exam. Am I gonna have to do this calibration dance every time? Not necessarily, but it's worth the wait. Give me two more minutes and you'll see exactly what BD analysis is capable of. One more sec. Need to get the pain receptor limiters in. Okay. All set. You need to test your profile first. Tossing in a sample view. Can use it to get to know the editor. Now let me see. Where could we? Can't he just use my recording? Why are we wasting time? So we don't risk our necks. Sides won't take a sec. Got something here. Should be perfect. Boot it up. Mm-hmm. Let me give you the tailored version first. Let you get your bearings. Then we'll jump into editing mode. Be diving in in three, two, Plan simple, do nothing odd, don't get creative. You go in, snatch the cash, get out. And we sell the BD to those psycho freaks from the studio. Got it, got it. And remember, everything on full blast. They'll spot us extra for a wicked adrenaline high. Okay, on you go. Everybody, on the ground, I want to see you kissing the flooring, money, now, or I will fucking drop you, I swear to God, whoa, yeah, hey, uh, uh, now, before I blow your fucking head off.
a flash of intense shock. I can still feel it, I remember. Fuck, that last second. Could have warned me how much it hurts to die. Trust me, real death hurts much, much more. Not so sure about that. You'll be fine. Got everything set up? Let's switch over to editing mode. I'll sever the link to the BD Roller's sensory array. You'll be able to look around freely. Full scene's yours. Full cam control in analysis mode, so move around, zoom in and out, whatever else you come up with. Think of it as your own little sandbox. So, analysis mode, you control playback. Can even pause when you feel the need. Then you use the editor console to unpause. Try it. Plan simple. Do nothing odd. Don't get creative. You go in, snatch the cash, get out, and we sell the BD to those psycho freaks from the studio. Got it, got it. Dream as hell, right? Well, that's not all. You can speed things up or rewind, whatever you like. Give it a try. Rewind. Bring no, it back I... to the top. Now... All good. Neat. Now try fast forwarding a bit. Plan simple. Do nothing off the creative. You go in, snatch cash, get out. Okay. You can also reset the recording. That'll take you right back to the beginning. Try it. Now for some fun. This here's why you came in the first place. In analysis mode, you get to view and even scan details of the enviro recorded by the BD roller. Focus on the heat. The gun this gonk gets from his buddy at the beginning. Now scan it. Plan simple. Do nothing odd. Don't get creative. You go in, snatch the cash, get out, and we sell the BD to those psycho freaks from the studio. Got it, got it. And remember, everything on full blast. They'll spot us extra for a wicked adrenaline hype. On you go. Okay, right here. Excellent. Let's move on. Now, heads up. In analysis mode, you can ferret out background noise and conversations if the roller got close enough. This tech records everything. Every little detail. Even the sights and sounds the roller was never aware of. To see the sources of the recorded sensory signals, switch to the audio layer in the editor. Go ahead and try that now. Okay, good. Now you should see several sound signatures in the store. Choose one and hone in on it. Okay. Fuck! On you ah, go. Little shitheads! Go restock. I'll take the register. How about you suck a bag of dicks, eh? So, any thoughts? Unbelievable. Seriously, like what's happening right next to me. Yeah, it's how BD recording implants work. They pick up everything, all the elements in the background. Then an editor tweaks them, makes them pop. Keep playing with the sound, explore it a bit. We'll move on when you get bored. Sometimes you can analyze extra layers in the raw, stuff the roller's cyberware picked up. Like what? Ev's got Kiroshi optics that grab infrared, meaning you should be able to grab heat signatures from her recording. Huh. Hella nice. 
Now let's wait till the guy punches out the gong at the counter. Peeps, too. Walk up to the wounded chick. Try scanning her. All right, next thing. Scroll forward to the part where our artist gets a lead injection. Now, or I will fucking drop you, I swear to God! Whoa! Yeah! Hey! Uh, uh, now! Before I blow your fucking head off! See that? They shot him and he never saw it coming. But you will. Here it comes. My favorite part of the game. See the blinking thing over the entrance? Surveillance cam. Must have caught our shooter. You'll see in a sec. Cam feeds to the screen behind the clerk. Roll back to where the screen's in the kid's field of vision. Then scan it. Chumba shot him. Probably planned to all along. Must have got a nice slice of cred on the black market for a BD like this. BD freaks are ready to pay a preem for a real flatline. Anyway, if you've seen enough, you can exit. Yeah, it's impressive, right? It's too bad most of the BDs we do here are only good for flogging the log. Anyway, you ready to do this? Look at your wreck? Dunno, I... Let's take a break. Still feel like that kid when... Oh, yeah. I think I'm done. V, there's no time. Get it together, please. Okay. Okay. Go ahead. Just need T-Bug to link in. Whoa, 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 who? Running for my crew, security specialist. She'll tell me what to look for while we analyze. No problem, I hope. Actually, it is a problem. Not what we agreed, Ev. Judy, T-Bug's a professional, discreet to a fault. You can trust her. Why? Because you say so? Please, Judy. I'd never expose you to any danger. You know that. Okay, V. Call T-Bug and we'll dive in. Hey, V. What's happening? Bug, listen. I got some useful footage from Compecky Plaza. It's a brain dance. Compecky? Oh, thought as much. Someone there with you? Unimportant, T-Bug. Please focus. Need your help. Got no clue what I'm supposed to look for once I'm in. Alright, see if I can walk you through it. Jacking into your tech now. Mm, you've got to give me access. Opening port 1779. Secure protocol? Good, I'm going in. Should be getting my request... now. Got it. You ready? A millisec. Okay, connection confirmed. Now some quick tip ice and we're clear. Ready to dance. Fire up, Judy.
Alright, V. Eyes open. Gotta find out where Yorinobu's keeping the relic. You look like a cut and fuckable meat, are you? Evelyn. She... I felt her fear. Sure got it under control quick, too. I said, no! They'll have my head for this. Then, you shall perish for a good cause. But uh, Make yourself comfortable. I need a minute to... Listen in on that conversation, V. Could be something important. Finish. Change, and he'll live forever in his tiny, frozen bubble. We'll listen to this. Saburo is an adult despot. Wow, champagne's decent. removed from reality. Taste boosted somehow? Stuck in no, some fossilized vision of a world Same bubbly, you'll that no longer in exists. Of a world that may never have existed. We have not seen eye to eye for the past 20 years. I am quite sure we want now. Noted. In a hmm, hung up. Go back to when they first start talking. Need to hear the whole thing. Huh. Sorry to make you wait. Business can be stupid. Hmm. It wasn't long. Not even long enough for me to grow bored. Is everything all right? You seem tense, edgy. A moment. It will pass. I can get to work on that. Just one condition. You wish to make demands of me? Only one. Focus on me. Oh, got any candy left? Stuff was pretty fun last time. Bedroom, nightstand. I've got an idea. Be right back. Very nice, but come here already. Just a sec, looking for the perfect thing. Ah, oh, you'll like this. Oh, fuck. It's like I'm really... V, eye on the prize, focus. Warikome. I miss this. You. I know. shall perish for a good cause. But... Shit, camera's packed with new tech. Motion sensors, heat sig activators, IFF. You skilled enough to kill it all? Mucho more than enough. Just need access to their subnet. I need a minute to finish. I need a minute to finish. 
The program is still in the trial phase. We cannot take it to market as is. We shall see soon enough. Please speak with your father. He's taken a particular interest in this project. He can certainly explain the risks. My father's a tired, visualless old greybeard who thinks nothing will change and he'll live forever in his tiny frozen bubble. I should not even be listening to such things. You will listen to this. Saburo is an adult despot, utterly removed from reality. Stuck in some fossilized vision of a world that no longer exists. Of a world that may never have existed. We have not seen eye to eye for the past 20 years. I am quite sure we want now. Read the documentation carefully. The relic requires specific storage conditions. You must no, provide them. In a Heard that? Relic docks gotta be around here somewhere. Look for them. Here in a drone, ventilation and cooling, servers, gotta be. Fancy doodads in here need to be controlled. Sorry to make you wait. Business can be stupid. Hmm. It wasn't long. Not even long enough for me to grow bored. Is everything all right? You seem tense. Edgy. A moment. It will pass. Hmm. I can get to work on that. Just one condition. You wish to make demands of me. Only one. Focus. On me. Oh, got any candy left? Steph was pretty... Fun last time. Bedroom. Nightstand. I've got an idea. Be right back. Very nice. But come here already. Just a sec. Looking for the perfect thing. Ah, you'll like this. Manual details a special temp controlled container. Relic needs to be kept real cool. So, chip's gotta stay in the freezer. Yep, could damage it otherwise. Okay, switch on thermal layer detection in the editor. Should be easier to spot where you are know who's keeping the chip. Looks like Mr. Arasaka had something to celebrate. You really think you'll find the chip in there? No way. Tim's too low. Could fluctuate. Nice try, though. Just a fancy ass fridge. Tip doesn't match the guidelines. Won't find a thing here.
You shall perish for good cause. But uh... Mates of the The heat sig matches the spec in the docks. Yorinobu's got the case here, guaranteed. Mm hmm. We got it. Good work. Looks like we got everything we need. Quit out of the editor. Get everything you need? Yep, that'll do. Thanks, Judy. We got it. Later, T-Bug. Nice work today. See you soon. I'll wipe the cash on your data. You were never here. Keep it. I'll put it on Ev's tab. Portable device for handling BDs. I already uploaded your calibration settings. Not as sophisticated as what we got here, but should do the trick. And it keeps you out of harm's way. Clever. Speaking of harm's way, know what I see looking at you? Walking, talking corpses. Judy, relax. We'll never know. Evelyn, please. No shortcuts. You go that route, City will always win. So be careful. Of course I will be. Besides, we'll talk in a bit. Let's walk. What now? V. Do this job for me. I mean me alone. No splitting the payout with anyone else. No middlemen. No decks. Well? I agree. What do you They'll think? 
hell to pay, for sure. I know. Whatever you decide, it stays between us. I can offer 50%. Eddie's enough to do whatever the hell you like. I'll be finished. Dex won't forgive a dirt move like this. Dex isn't the only fixer in town. But my offer's the only one you'll ever get. <sighs> Let me think about it. Mm-hmm. If you need me, call. I'll send you my number. Okay. Good luck. Now go. I need a few words. How are things looking, Mr. V? Of course! Turns out Evelyn's recording from Compeki was worth our time. Beautiful. Oh, T-Bug no, already called. You. Said she's working her match. And the flathead. Nothing yet. On it now. T-Bug says no chance of that ship without that buy. To work then, Mr. V. Tiger, babe. I'm off the clock, hon. out here. Start by telling me how you got this number. You're more than your number. Heard you misplaced a convoy. You shut him up! 
Spill what you know. Don't make me wait. Nuh uh, not on the horn. Let's meet, cut a deal. A deal? Fine. First exit off Skyline, driving towards the NID. Storm Channel under the overpass. Meredith Stout. Take it you were the one to call? That'd be me. Thought you could blackmail me, fucker! Set conditions! Got any more for me? Ready? All set. Now answer my questions. Honestly. Forthrightly. Are you here alone? Got guardian angels with 50 caliber snipes aimed at your skull. You don't let me go. Your dogs will have to glue you back together. He's lying. Try that again, and it's two million volts. Got it? Do a sweep now. Is he your contact? Is he the one who leaked intel on the convoy? That guy? Never seen him before. Checks out. Listen, I know where the transport is. I can help you. Just want a favor in return. <sighs> I told you! I fucking told you! I'm not the mole! Jesus Christ! Shut him up! Unhand me now before I... <sighs> Him, you can let go. Wanna hear what he has to say? I need a bot. Flathead model. Guys who ripped you off have it. Promise me that bot. I'll point the finger. You have a plan how to deal with them? Could just take it by force, but they're expecting payment. So I could go that route too. Fine, the latter. But on one condition, you pay with our money. Sounds solid enough. I'm in.
You pay with that chip, and that's all you gotta worry about. Try to fuck me right. and anyway, Eddie's and I'll be seeing you queen. real soon. You're making a mistake! This cut's already good as dead! And she'll take you down with her! Ah, there you are. Let me hear what you squared away. Sedex already paid the Maelstromist for the Corpo bot. Thing is, can't be sure the Gangoons are still willing to hand it over. He paid up front? Híjole. Well, whatever. Let's go get this tech. You skin yet? You got a plan? Hello? That shit can go smoothly. This is Maelstrom. Gang world ain't too complicated. Might's right, the strong survive. Either you fuck others, or you get fucked. So, into the Borg Beast Den? Let's go see these bastards. All right, let's knock on their door. See if they even open up. I hate these Borg fuckers. It's had to be them. It's a gang like any other, right? I think the Valentinos. They follow God and the Santa Madre. Honor means something to them. You know what they want, how they get it, and what pisses them the fuck off. With Maelstrom, you just never know. Go on, let them know we're here. Uh, don't know you. Want to talk to Royce? Dex sent us. Main room. We've been waiting. Uh, cozy place. Could use a few plants, though. Oh, yeah. They look damn well prepared. Don't think I've ever seen security like this in a chow factory. Yeah. 
gear from the Jack Convoy. Gotta be. Must have been all over it like maggots on dead meat. Anti-personnel mine. Directional shrapnel spitter. My favorite. Subtle. Model MT0 D12, called the Flathead. And? The hell you care? Guy I represent already paid brick for it. I'm just here for the pickup. I can talk direct to Royce if necessary. Nah, you talk to me. Name's Tum Tum. Now couch, planet. Militech's not gonna come looking for it? Fuck them. They can hop around and try. We'll remove the serial number and lift an access locks using our soft. Once it's yours, it's yours. Need to see it. Suit yourself. Fucking tricked out this thing. Dynamic thermal optic camo armor. Full cognitive immersion with a Raven controller. Pimped out prototype actuators made of titanium vanadium Kevlar composite. And watch this! Fully integrated link too, so when the spider starts crawling up walls dangling from ceilings. Mm hmm Could lose your lunch. So what you think? Yep, we'll take it. Sure. Yeah. Let's see a cred. Brick got it.
around here, do you? Come on. Can't expect me to pay for this thing twice. And who the fuck are you to say what can and can't be? You'll pay twice, because I say you'll pay twice. Alright. You want the flathead? I better see some eddies. Seeing as you already got the eddies for it, you ought to offer us a discount. A big one. A discount? Fuck. You know, you never did say who sent you. Never did say who you're working for. Dexter Deshaun. That's who. Dexter Deshaun. The lard ass who punching animal fucked half a Pacifica? <laughs> he ain't dead? No. He's alive, well, and kicking. He sends his regards. So you're gonna consider my offer now? Bang. I just wait! Bring it, cocksuckers! I'm not on the beat! Come on! Oh, shit! Let me go, on! Mierda! Cut off! Grab the gear! Bot and control shot! Quick! Got the set, bot and controller. Yeah, let's go. Quicker the better. Let's get out of here. Production line. Plus, I thought you loved me. Really, no other way.
Need to reload! <laughs> 